The second stage of labor is when you go from a fully dilated cervix, now the baby is coming down what we call the birth canal, coming from the opening of the, of the uterus all the way down through the vagina and then being born through the opening of the vagina, going those so six inches or so. That's when the head is down and you feel like you're gonna make the hugest poop you ever made. So that process is squeeze and squeeze and, and, and they will measure the baby's head inch by inch as it's coming down until finally you see the, the, um, the skin of the baby's scalp coming right at the opening of the vagina. That's called crowning. That's when now the big deal happens where you have to deliver the baby's head through the, through the opening of the vagina. Um, one of the things that you're doing during that second stage of labor is actually massaging the opening of the vagina, stretching it really, to kind of get it to open a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. A fully dilated cervix is 10 centimeters. The baby's head actually is um, 11 centimeters. I don't know whose idea that was, <laughs> but it's why they call it the ring of fire. You know, it's, it's a big deal getting that through. And the baby's head actually doesn't come straight out. It comes out in a twisting uh, manner because if you were trying to get a ring off of a tight finger or a cork out of a bottle, you would twist it to help it to come out. And so that's how the baby's head is coming. And then once the baby's head is delivered, usually the body comes really quickly after that. And that is the end of the second stage.